Hey everyone, we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager and we are playing some Resident Evil Remake. Chris. <laughs> but before we do anything, we're gonna- oh jeez. Wait, what? Oh, right, when I was going to the save point. A zombie jumped. I'm jumping- yeah! So, I went through the balcony again as a shortcut, and a zombie was like, sup? <laughs> it came bursting out of the door when I went th after I went through the balcony. But, we have the armor key, which means I should be able to open the door that Rebecca is behind. Which is weird, because why is Rebecca behind a locked door? That only has well, it has two exits technically. Oh, my mouse is It has two exits technically, but it only has one entrance into that area. It's not like it's not like it loops around or there's any other way she could have gotten there. But no, nope. Mm -mm. nope. She has somehow magically managed to get in there. Are there zombies here now? Still no. You use the armor key, and I have tea because I always have tea. Tea and scurves. <gasps> it's Becky! You. Chris Redfield, Alpha Team. We're here to rescue you. Richard, what the hell happened to you? Chris, this place. Get your team out of here. How did he get his face Demons. injured? That, oh. Everywhere. Nice clipping Don't issues talk. on your elbow, dude. He seems to have been bitten by a poisonous snake. The big ass snake. The bite mark is huge. Then why would you think snake? It's not just any ordinary snake. Well, Richard probably told her he needs <laughs> serum. I left it in another room. I'll go get it. I love how she says Hold serum on. in all caps. <laughs> the subtitle is serum in all caps. Okay, so we gotta go get the serum. Which Rebecca conveniently left in another room. Okay. So the serum is... Back in that safe point. Of course it is. So, problem... Is, if you let Richard die here... Then Rebecca will help you against Plant 42 and create V-Jolt. Which is what you do as Jill. You make V-Jolt... Well, you can make V-Jolt to make the fight easier. As Chris, Chris is too stupid to make Vigil. <laughs> Seriously. Chris is too stupid to make Vigil. So we're back has to make it. But the thing is, if you let Richard live, then Rebecca doesn't make Vigil for you because she's busy taking care of Richard. But she will get the serum for you if you get poisoned. So there's that. Hey, Zumble Boy. Bye, Zumble Boy. I also know that the one downstairs look like it looks like it's gone. Or at least he's in a different section of the downstairs and they just haven't gone further to open up the other armor door. Serum! Got the serum. Yoink! Okay. And then he has to make this trip again if you get po poisoned during the um during the yawn fight. It's like, yeah. You're poisoned, you're like, well, shit. Hey, look, zombie. Bye, zombie. <laughs> They're so easy to dodge when you use the alternate um, control scheme. I just run circles around them. It's funny to me. Hello, what did I call you? Jaredine. That's what it was. Hi, Jaredine. How you doing? The two named zombies, Jaredine and Eduardo. I'll probably add more and then forget their names, too. I'm sure it's fine. <laughs> step, 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 step. Everything's fine. No, oh, that's where the end game and everything blows up. Because I like blowing things up. Richard! I got you a thing to put in your face! Because that's how serums work. Hope this is what you wanted. Thank you. Yeah, how the hell would he know? Now, Richard, hang in there. 
Here, take it. It's a radio. Take care of yourself, Rebecca. Richard. He's okay. He's okay, is, like, is he dead? Did I not Rebecca, go fast enough? <laughs> it's not safe here. Let's get Richard to a safer place. Right. Do I have an escort mission? Oh, okay. Office. Just fade to black. Anderson. Good. Richard needs you now. Except he's hella infected by the T-Virus. As soon as Richard gets better, we'll come after you. Rebecca, you okay with a gun? Yes. Alright. He has no facial expression. Chris has no facial expression. Be careful. Okay? Also, Rebecca's voice actress keeps changing. This is this voice actress is totally different than her Resident Evil Zero voice actress, and the two games aren't that far apart from each other. Anyway. Okay, yeah, he's still down here. Hey, friend! Come over to the convenient pool in the middle of the hallway. Please. Please and thank you! Uh oh. Go straight as a gun. And nope! <laughs> and that is how you juke a dude. You use the armor key. I think I need to get the fertilizer for this section. Hey, a thing. There's zombies down. Oh no, I have to use the thing in here. Damn it! Right? Yep, I have to use the thing here. Great. Wonderful. Stupendous brilliance. I know you guys want to hear the four itchy tasty, but we're not going to hear the four itchy tasty just yet. Itchy tasty's for later. Oh, it looks like my nose is really itchy right now. Ah, itchy nose. Yeah. Oh shit. Mammy. Mammy. Yeah! <laughs> Dodged a mother trucker. <laughs> Let's go see uh, Richard again. This hey, dude. room is equipped with all sorts of medical supplies. I could pretty much treat any wound. Want me to treat your wounds? Uh, that sounds subjective. Not right now. No, I'm okay. <laughs> Except for my lack of me, facial expression. No problem. But we're very short on medical supplies, so take care of yourself. My voice changes constantly from game to game. <laughs> also, I love for the like, Richard's gonna be fine, but he's absolutely 1000% infected with the T virus right now. Like, uh, I still have the sword key. <laughs> I don't know what freaking door I'm supposed to use it on. Here, I take it. I'm gonna find the door. I'm gonna find the freaking door it's supposed to be used on, okay? It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. Okay, Zombo. How you doing, buddy? Whatcha? You tried, you thought? And you failed. <laughs> Okay. If I'm remembering correctly. No, that's not what I want. That there we go. Yeah, that room definitely leads to the plant room. I need the fertilizer to use that room. And to get to the fertilizer, I need a small key. Because I need the small key to do the thing with the stuff and I'm a zombie now. Hmm. <laughs> Yes, there's zombies outside that corridor. They're just waiting for me to come through. That's why I'm waiting to go down that corridor until I have the fertilizer. And what do I get for my trouble? Shut again, shells. Brilliant. Gimme. And now I need to get the other side, which I think is the yellow gem. It was a red gem in the original game, but it's the yellow gem in this one. 
I don't... F no, the Magnum's not back there. The Magnum was back there in the original game, but it's not back there in this one. It's in a different area, in a cemetery. Always need the Magnum. Magnum too strong. Okay, I don't want to do it, because this room is entirely useless to the plot, but you guys want to see it. <laughs> I know you guys would never forgive me if I didn't go into this room. It's a hoogan. Hey, look. I wonder what this could be about. Herp derp. Keeper's Diary. May 9th, 1998. Play poker tonight with Scott and Elias from security and Steve from research. Steve was the big winner, but I think he was cheating. Scumbag. May 10th, 1998. One of the higher-ups assigned me to take care of a new creature. It looks like a skinned gorilla. Feeding instructions would give it live animals. When I threw in a pig, the creature seemed to play with it, tearing up the pig's legs and pulling out the guts before it actually started eating. May 11th, 1998. Around 5 a.m., Scott woke me up. Scared the shit out of me, too. He was wearing a protective suit. He handed me another one and told me to put it on. Said there had been an accident in the basement lab. I just knew something like this would happen. Those bastards in research never sleep, even on holiday. May 12th, 1998. I've been wearing the damn spacesuit since yesterday. My skin's getting grimy and feels itchy all over. The goddamn dogs have been looking at me funny, so I decided not to feed them today. Screw them. May 13th, 1998. Went to the infirmary because my back is all swollen and feels itchy. They put a bandage on it and told me I didn't need to wear the spacesuit anymore. All I want to do is sleep. May 14th, 1998. Found another big blister on my foot this morning. Ended up dragging my foot all the way to the dog's pen. They were quiet all day. Which is weird. Then I realized some of them had escaped. Maybe this was their way of getting back at me for not feeding them the last three days. If anybody finds out, I'll have my head handed to me. May 16th, 1998. Rumors going around that a researcher who tried to escape the estate last night was shot. My, in my entire body feels hot and itchy, and I'm sweating all the time now. I scratched the swelling in my arm, and a piece of rotten flesh just dropped off. What the hell's happening to me? May 19th, 1998. Fever gone, but itchy. Today, hungry and eat doggy food. May 21st, 1998. Itchy, itchy. Scott came. Ugly face, so killed him. Tasty. Four. Itchy. Tasty. Hey! <laughs> I say that? Way to avert expectations! Itchy Tasty Dude didn't pop up. Well then, usually he like pops up behind him, but he didn't but he didn't pop out of the thing, he just shook it. Ah, weird. That's my Oh hi Zumble. How you doing? You want brains? You can't have them! <laughs> Okay, where am I going now? Uh, I haven't gotten everything in that room. I haven't, didn't get everything in that room. I didn't get everything in that room. Uh, I need to do the music part, but I can't do the music part, I don't think, because I need Rebecca to do the music part. Is that what I need the mount for? It's like sheet music mount? Maybe. So, do I have room in my inventory? No. I'm gonna run and get that. Because I have a feeling the mount is for sheet music. Because it looks like it would be for sheet music. Might be wrong here, though. So, this guy tried to grab me when I came into the room, so I shot him. And I blew his freaking head off. I don't even have to set his body on fire because I blew him up. Brilliant! <laughs> so I'm going to get... The thing that I've already forgotten what the thing was. No, Are I don't okay? want you, Becca. Go away. We've already played as you in Resident Evil Zero. Okay, I need this. I think. I think I need this. So I won't have to worry about that zombie anymore, because I blew his head off. I was planning on running to get the kerosene, because I didn't want to deal with him anymore because he was being annoying and he grabbed me and made me waste one of my freaking defense items. And his body's gone! Great! 
because that's a good way to show that your uh, monster is dead, is just remove the body. Despite the fact that they are um, undead monsters. Don't think that's how that works. Just saying. Okay, zombie friend. I don't... Try to grab me, I dare you. Get right! Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> At least I won't have to worry about that guy in this corridor anymore. <laughs> Darn it, I got so far with using s minimum bullets. But... It's, 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 yeah. It's, yeah. Can I made of oak wood? Expensive looking grand piano. Balls. Okay, there's an ink ribbon that I really don't need. Fine wine. Obvious thing that I need to push. Hey, look at thing! You can't carry any items. Wait, what? Oh, do I not use the mountain here? Okay! Apparently I don't. Ball. Something over here that I haven't gotten. I don't think I've been down here yet. Oh, there's a sword key. Ah, oh, there we go. That's where the sword key goes. Discard, yes. I could go down there, but now I want to go get the sheet music. <laughs> Since I just threw away the key that I, for some reason, know I don't need to use anymore. In before we all find out that all the Resident Evil protagonists, in fact, know a lot more than they let on and know exactly everything to do with the mansion slash areas that they are in. Because they happen to magically know they don't need a key anymore. Let me take the musical score, yes. Then grand piano. What? Okay. Oh, right, it's missing a... Yeah. Section of the music is missing, leaving only the beginning and the end of the music. Okay. Can I combine it? No. Why do I keep thinking that those things can be used together? <laughs> they look like they can, but... they then... <laughs> okay, I went into the room. Hey, look, zombie. Hey, look, zombie. Is there a thing? No, I can see the key, dumbass. <laughs> cool. Now I can get to the area with the fertilizer. Oh, I'm on caution. <laughs> hey, look, zombie. Okay, everything's fine now. I'm just gonna leave. It's fine, right? <laughs> Yeah, everything's fine. Oh no! This is awful. Oh wait. Yeah. Can't grab me. Can't grab me. Can't grab me. Okay, you're gonna try and grab me. Okay, bye. <laughs> you got your friend crawling around the ground. I'm never coming in here again. <laughs> I think. I should remember if I come in there again. I know you do in the original game. And it has the epic music in one version. I think it was the director's cut. <laughs> okay, so I got the small key, and I still have the armor key. So a couple of areas we can go through. Um, there's a lot of stuff on the east wing, and a lot of stuff on the second floor. Well, and by a lot, I mean a couple. And I still need to get the emblem. Which I need... Okay, I need to get the fertilizer to get it one map. Oh my god, there's so much stuff to keep track of! So many things! Gotta keep track of it all! Dooby 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 doo. Let's go in here first. It's locked! Oh wait, it needs the helmet key, never mind. Then... Um... 
It could go all the way around. Oh, I need. I can get the fertilizer over there. Don't have a lot of room though. I'm gonna use that. <laughs> Let's go to the second floor first then. Oh, I should have done this before going to Rebecca because now that's always gonna be filled with zombies, isn't it? Maybe. Possibly. No? Oh, well then. Fuck's sake. Who said there's allowed to be zombies in there? And... Puzzle. That I can't remember the freaking solution to. So I'm just gonna push things until it works. Yeah, it didn't do anything. See, what I need to do is I need to get all of these guys back in their places. For fuck's sake! Go back! Oh, fuck you! <laughs> okay. Fine, I'll push you. And I'll push you. You asshole! Could you- could you not? See, if you don't do this and you try to hit the button, it'll just gas you to death. I hate you. There we go. Wait, no. Ah! Oh! I was so close. You fucker. Hey, I think I did it. <laughs> it just took off a minute. Yay! I can push the button. Woe to those who disturb my sleep. The switch here, press it. Yes. Dun dun dun. It's a books. Mysterious boots. Take the jewelry box. And examine the jewelry box. So now I have another puzzle here. I need to hit the switch, press it, yes. Press it. Okay. Press it. Ah oh, crap. Yes, yes, I get it. It appears as if you failed. Okay, press it, so is the other side first. Press it. Press it. What? Okay, maybe I have to do the heart first. Maybe. Uh, uh, okay, there we go. <laughs> Where's the mask inside? I got a death mask. Mouth without eyes, nose, or mouth. Yay! Now where else do I go? Oh, there's that door. There's that door. There's that door. That door, that door. And that puzzle. Let's go through the one we're near, because why not? It's locked from the other side, because it's rude AF. I, like, I can just go around through this other room, it's fine. That door will stay forever locked. I think this is the room that you have to stay for back in. I think. I might be rang. You use the armor key. And nothing bad ever happened ever again forever. Herbies! <gasps> Actually, no. Melodies for now. You might be able to unlock it with an old key. Oh, but I need a fertilizer! Shit! I need the old key for the fertilizer room! Well... Look at that angle! <laughs> hey, there we go! Convenient! <laughs> Wait, what? 
Maybe someone took something and left in a hurry. Maybe it was Whisker. Okay, so there's all kinds of fun stuff in here. So I'm actually going to go into the next room because I'm fairly close to an item box save room here. And I can always just ferry everything down there off screen because I'm about at the end of the video. But we're going to go investigate here first. I've unlocked an old key. Yes. So now I still have one that I can use in the fertilizer room. Or the place where you get the fertilizer. I like a puzzle. <laughs> I don't think I have enough room. Yeah, I don't have enough room in my inventory for the puzzle. So we're just going to read. And I'll do the actual puzzle part in the next video. For now, researchers will. There is a letter. June 3rd, 1998. My dearest Alma, let me apologize for not being able to call you. The man wearing sunglasses didn't permit any phone calls. Sorry, Alma. I sit here trying to think of where to begin, how to explain a few simple words all that's happened in my life since we last spoke, and I already I fail. I hope this letter finds you well, and that you'll forgive the tangents of my pen. If this isn't easy for me. Even as I write, I can feel the simplest of concepts slipping away, lost to feelings of despair and confusion. But I have to tell you what's in my heart before I can rest. Alma, please believe that what I'm telling you is the truth. The entire story would take hours for me to tell you, and time is short, so accept these things as fact. Last month, there was an accident in the lab and the virus we were studying leaked. All my colleagues were infected are, who were, were infected are dead or dying, and the nature of the disease is such that those still living have lost their senses. This virus robs the victim of their humanity, forcing them in their sickness to seek out and destroy life. Even as I write these words, I can hear them, pressing against my door like mindless, hungry animals. Alma, I've tried to survive only to see you again, but my efforts have only delayed the inevitable. I am infected, and there is no cure for what will follow, except to end my life before I lose the only thing that separates me from them. My love for you. In an hour, I have entered... In an hour, I'll have entered my eternal sleep where there is peace. Please understand. Please know that I am sorry. Martin Crackhorn. Yep. He shot himself. Is that a passport? It looks like a passport on there. Ah, oh, no, man. But either way, I'm gonna leave this room for later, and I'm gonna go clear out the other rooms and take them to the item box. So my name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I have been playing some Resident Evil Remake Christmas Scenario. I'll see you all in the next video.